Hello, uh, I'm Mr Muir. I'm a computer science and information technology teacher here at Helston Sixth Form. Two subjects that are in high demand and used practically everywhere. Right, in computer science, we believe in teaching from a bottom-up approach. Uh, that, that is starting by understanding the hardware, all that cool electronic good stuff inside the case, you know, the CPU RAM, and how computer science are able to represent all of this uh, sound, text, images, numbers, reality, as it were, using just a collection of transistors and logic gates. Okay, so let's see what's under this. Right, I think this is an old PC left from the upgrade, and um, so now we've got a brand new shiny sixth form centre. Um, but like what most people, I'm sure you'll know this anyway, because most of you coming in here will be interested in computers. But as you can see, under this is a pinnacle of what I think a human achievement, which is the CPU. And we can open this up, we've got all sorts of good stuff. Right, um, I notice we don't have a graphics card in here, so I think this must have been one of the old office PCs uh, before the refresh. Right, throughout the course, we will look at what's going on inside this, this stuff here, right, and inside the bonnet, what's happening at the hardware level, and then work up to the software that controls it. Excuse me, Mr Taylor would like his computer back. This is Mr Taylor's PC. Uh, uh, okay, I thought it looked a bit too tidy. Right, um, yeah, so we will look at software and software development. Uh, we will look at how data is exchanged between devices. We will look at how programming and using C Sharp, Python, and for assessment there are two uh, exams and the students will get to their, to sink their teeth into an NEA, the non-exam assessment, when they can do practically anything. So, for instance, using the school's virtual reality machines. Right. As you can see, Helston Sixth Form has their brand new swanky pants centre. Right, and it still has that brand new smell. Um, both computer science and information technology students, well actually everybody, uh, can make use of the new study centre. Um, computer science and IT students will also be able to make use of the department's virtual reality headsets. They are new, but have been worked very hard. Um, the students will they make excellent use of them. For instance, examining how to utilise multiple inputs and outputs. And if they want to, um, they can use them in their non-exam assessments, so they can programme using them. Virtual reality, right, the temptation to use uh, VR to just mess about shoot things or hit boxes with music is very real but of course Houston Sixth Form students are above such things. Uh, guys, guys, uh, I thought you were meant to be doing... The second course I wish to talk about is the BTEC in IT. This is a direct equivalent to one A level so you will pick this plus a couple of others. Uh, computer science and IT obviously work very well together. IT is such a vocational subject and as you know IT is ubiquitous, it's everywhere. And there are many, many careers and of course university opportunities. Right, in BTEC IT there are two exams and two pieces of coursework. Uh, the students will learn about IT systems, the hardware, software, data exchange, you know, how this information is transmitted from one device to another, legislation and loads more. Right, it's not money that makes the world go round anymore. I mean, you probably know that it's data, right? So um, students will explore data and learn how to create data systems, relational databases, and like it or not, as you definitely know, social media is everywhere and more and more companies are leaving the brick and mortar and going online. So if a company to stay in the game, they must have an online presence. Um, and just not just that, a social media presence. So the students will analyse, plan and carry out a social media campaign for their first coursework assignment. And for their second, they will do the same, but this time for producing a company website. So really practical skills. So the students you see here, right, have very recently started their website development uh, coursework. And they're just learning, so practicing their website skills. So we see this student. Hello. Oh, I'm I'm great. Right, so just have a look. Right, so here we go. So this is the type of things we've made. And let's see. Right. If you need any more information about either computer science or BTEC IT, please feel free to contact one of the members at Helston Sixth Form Centre. Thank you very much.